Life Audio. Welcome to the Crosswalk Devotional. We're glad to have you listening with us. Today's topic is the importance of looking beyond fear of the unknown to God who helps us overcome fear. We'll return with the devotional after a brief message from our sponsors. God is Greater Than Ghosts Written and read by Whitney Hopler Shortly before dawn, Jesus went out to them, walking on the lake. When the disciples saw him walking on the lake, they were terrified. It's a ghost, they said, and cried out in fear. But Jesus immediately said to them, Take courage. It is I. Don't be afraid. Matthew fourteen twenty five through 27 NIV In October, the days grow shorter, the nights longer, and the world around us pays attention to spiritual mysteries. During the Halloween season, many of us may find ourselves intrigued by ghost stories and other paranormal tales. People have told ghost stories throughout history, across many cultures. Ghosts spark our curiosity and entertain our imagination. As we approach Halloween, our society amplifies this fascination with a strong focus on ghosts and other scary mysteries. While these stories can be fascinating, They also stir up fear. The Bible describes how Jesus' disciples thought they saw a ghost walking on water. It looked like something inexplicable and terrifying. Their fear was understandable, given the extraordinary nature of the event and the darkness of the night. When they saw the mysterious figure walking on the water, their first reaction was to be afraid. But it turned out to be not bad news, but good news. It was their Savior, Jesus, who immediately reassured them, Take courage. It is I. Don't be afraid. When Jesus spoke to them, he cleared up the mystery and encouraged them to choose courage over fear. This passage reminds us that when we face the unknown, our first instinct might be fear, but God calls us to focus on him instead. The world may be full of mysteries, but God makes himself known through mysteries. God is our loving Heavenly Father, our anchor in the storm, and the one who holds the answers to all our questions about life, death, and eternity. As we move through the Halloween season, it's easy to get caught up in the fun of ghost stories and the thrill of the unknown. But let's not forget that our curiosity about the afterlife and other scary mysteries can be better directed toward God, the creator of all things seen and unseen. While ghost stories may capture our imagination, they can't offer the peace, security, and truth that God provides. So, rather than allowing fear to take hold of us, we can ask God to fill us with his courage and presence. When we feel afraid or uncertain, we can turn to Jesus, who reassures us just as he did the disciples, saying, It is I. Don't be afraid. When faced with the unknown, our first instinct might be fear, but God calls us to trust in him. The world may be filled with mysteries, but God is our constantly reliable Heavenly Father, our source of strength, and the one who holds the answers to all our questions. So, let's remember that we can direct our curiosity about ghosts and other scary mysteries toward God, the creator of all things. God will tell us the truth about the mysteries we encounter. While ghost stories may entertain us, our primary focus should be on God, not ghosts. The one who walked on water, who conquered death, and who promises to be with us always is far more powerful and important than any ghost story. This October, let's allow our fascination with ghosts to draw us closer to God, who holds the keys to eternity and who promises to guide us through every fear with his perfect love. The thrill of discovering God's wondrous work in our lives is much stronger than any excitement we can get from scary mysteries. We don't need to be consumed by fear when we can ask God to fill us with courage. When we feel afraid or uncertain, 
we can turn to Jesus, who reassures us, It is I. Don't be afraid. Intersecting Faith and Life As you consider the importance of overcoming fear when you face the unknown, reflect on these questions. What fears of the unknown are you currently facing that you need to surrender to God? In what ways can you focus more on God's presence and promises rather than on the fear of the unknown? How can you use this Halloween season as an opportunity to draw closer to God and share God's peace with others? What practical steps can you take to remind yourself of God's power when fear tries to creep in? Further reading, John 14, 27, Isaiah 41, 10, 2 Timothy 1, 7, Psalm 23, 4, Philippians 4, 6 through 7. The Crosswalk Devotional is a production of Life Audio and Salem Media. If you liked what you heard today, please take a second to rate and review this podcast in your favorite podcast app so that more listeners like you can find the show. For more faith-filled, inspirational podcasts, visit us at lifeaudio.com.